Um, someone mentioned blue collar and, you, you know, we're, we're, we're very remiss um, when it comes to, or in fact, you think about the logistical nightmares we're having at the moment and some of the things happening in our world. Um, blue collar is, is, is high up there. Um, they are the feeder group to a lot of people that ultimately become managers and run businesses. And, and I, I heard someone actually say, I, I don't do blue collar. And I, I just, it made me just go, wow. Um, Paul, is there a difference between blue collar, white collar? And uh, would you mind just reflecting on that, please? Yeah, sure. Um, uh, so yes, there is, and no, there's not, um, which is probably a terrible answer. Um, so I guess primarily we're all human, right? Um, um, so no, there's not. Um, if you, if you, the, the difference, I'll come back to that in a second. Uh, the, the difference is that the, um, you know, to use blue, the, the framing blue collar um, or in councils, they say outdoor workers or whatever, but oftentimes it's very, um, they're more likely to be working either or always in a process operational role where it's um, just simply the execution of the task that's, that's needed. Um, so it can feel um, more, um, more that, that you're a cog oh yeah and that you're a cog in the machine right you're you're the, the delivery driver just doing deliveries right and you don't have that that level of um connection and emotional connection and quite a lot of them some of them work in teams but quite a lot of the time you're out mowing or you're out doing whatever it is that you're doing you know doing, doing the deliveries or, or whatever it might be so there's there's certainly a disconnect there's also oftentimes a collective cynicism about the ivory tower because the you know the the senior management don't know um, what we do every day they don't value us they don't get us and all that stuff so there's very easy to have a significant um cynicism of of that stuff uh, that that comes with that with that audience however the rest of it is that we are all actually human right so if you think about the negative talk um, that they'll have, so instead of being water cooler talk, it's smoko talk, right? Um, but that talk is still becomes positive if they feel heard, they feel acknowledged, if they feel valued, um, and it becomes negative, um, and it is about the money, if they feel like they're just a cog in the machine that no one cares about. Mm. And that is the same, whether you're working in an office and someone pings a task at you and you've got to do it, or you're, um, um, doesn't matter what color shirt you're wearing, you know, you a red shirt at Bunnings, a blue collar person in the field, or um, a person doing admin in, in, in an office, or be a team leader or a supervisor or a leading hand, you know, all those labels, if you feel um, acknowledged and valued and you're contributing, you want to stay, right? If you if you feel like a cog in a machine that no one cares about, it's just about the money because um, you're just there to, to do what you're paid to do and that's it. And so you'll go and get paid somewhere else. You know, you have, you have no connection. So I don't know if that's a useful framing for you or not. Stand the fire. <laughs>